Hi, I'm Dr. Elise Arabian, founder and spiritual director of Centerpiece Foundation and the Centerpiece Project. And today I'd like to talk to you about why creative people do really well with transpersonal psychologists. Um, generally, creative people think and live out of the box. They don't like to have, uh, or it's a rather counterintuitive for them to have a job that's eight to five where they go sit in a cubicle all day and have to report to, to their boss or their manager. Generally, creative people want to have a lot of space and freedom to think and feel and be inspired to do their art. And it's very similar with transpersonal psychology. Um, typically, practitioners in this field are people who think and live out of the box and don't adhere to conventional ways of thinking. And sometimes um, their life practices even leads them to exploring uh, spirituality, uh, mystical, and even shamanic realms of experience. And so they're always about exploring out of the mainstream life, um, what the mainstream life has to offer. And so when creative people and transpersonal psychologists come together, there's a wonderful synergy that's created between the two where um, the person's life can um, be explored in all levels and take on um, very different turns than where they, when they first or initially started therapy. An example of this uh, that I want to share with you today is um, a client, a woman I worked with uh, last year and um, for the purposes of this video I'm going to call her Rachel. When Rachel first came in she was in her um, mid-twenties and single at the time but was um, quite successful in her chosen profession. She was a, is a songwriter and um, had a very good job um, writing ly lyrics to pop music. And when she came in, she um, talked about how stressed and uh, depleted she felt as a result of this job, even though seemingly it seemed like it was uh, tapping to her creative side. What had ended up happening was that day after day she had to go into the studio and write uh, lyrics to music that she didn't really resonate with and um, the words that she had to write or come up with was just the same thing over and over again without much variation or really creativity involved and she was getting tired and drained of, of living like that or doing that kind of work day in and day out and so when she came um, to work with me we ended up exploring many other facets of her life and she came to realize that her spiritual practice is a very dominant part of her life and she loves to meditate and uh, go on retreats and do yoga and read a lot of uh, mindfulness books and as a result of that she realized that her uh, passion is very heart-centered and the kinds of work that she wants to do on herself and ultimately in her work is to write music and lyrics to these parts of herself uh, where she has struggled or has um, uh, has uh, been even there's been even been some trauma in her background but through that um, the inspiration to move on to heal and to change and to improve the quality of her life and she wanted that to be also the work that she does day in and day out. And so as a result, um, her life did take a different turn and she ended up um, not working with the same group of people that she had been for the past few years but felt motivated to move on and try something different in her life. Um, she, start, she got married, she um, started to do uh, much of this work with her partner who's a producer and together they started to venture out into totally different new grounds. And so uh, she's an example of uh, a creative individual who has passion and intention to live a more fulfilling life but often feels uh, or felt quite stifled and um, coming into this type of practice and working with a spiritually oriented therapist uh, enabled her to tap into that part of herself 
and um, find a different way to live out uh, her potential in life. Uh, if you're feeling that you may be a creative person who's uh, a little bit stifled at this time in your life, uh, please feel free to give me a call. My number is listed on my website. Uh, I offer a half hour free consultation. That way I get to hear your story and find out what's happening in your life and if in fact this is the right direction for you to take. Thank you.